Hey friends, do you love roast duck but don't know how to cook it? This week I'm sharing an unconventional roasting method for cooking tender and juicy duck. You'll love how simple this recipe is. Here's what we need. One duck, vodka five spice marinade, an orange, fresh ginger, fresh garlic, salt, onion powder, paprika, and ground black pepper. To stuff the bird, we will need the remainder of the orange, fresh ginger, fresh garlic, and green onions. Lastly, we need peanut oil and a paper grocery bag. To make the glaze, we need brown sugar, five spice powder, orange juice, honey, soy sauce, and ground ginger. Some other items we need are a bamboo skewer, twine, clear tape, and a stapler. First, grate the fresh ginger, zest the orange, and crush the garlic. To the bowl, we add salt, onion powder, ground black pepper, and paprika. Now just mix everything together, forming a soft paste. Remove the neck and other duck parts from inside the duck. We're going to wash this duck with salt, so sprinkle some salt on the outside and on the inside of the duck. Rub the salt all over the duck. Now we rinse the duck thoroughly with cool water, both on the inside and on the outside. Shake off the excess water and pat it thoroughly dry with some paper towels. If there's any excess skin around the neck, let's go ahead and trim this off. We can also cut off the fat pockets on either side of the opening. And let's trim off the tail. Using the tip of a sharp paring knife, pierce the skin. I'm holding the knife flat instead of upright so that I don't pierce the meat. Don't forget the other side of the bird as well. Drizzle the vodka five spice marinade on both sides of the duck. And then rub the marinade into the duck, coating it evenly. Let's take the marinade that we made earlier and coat the duck. Smear a little bit on the inside. Spread the remainder of the marinade all over the duck, coating it well. Place the duck in the refrigerator and allow it to marinate overnight. Let's preheat our oven to 325 degrees. We're going to roast the duck inside this paper grocery bag. To prevent it from burning, we need to cover it completely with peanut oil. Please make sure you use peanut oil and not another type of vegetable oil. Peanut oil has a very high tolerance for heat. If you have someone to help you, it's much easier if one person pours the oil while you coat the paper bag. When you're done, inspect the bag and make sure the entire bag is evenly coated with peanut oil. Check the inside of the bag as well. Let the bag soak up the oil while you continue with the next steps. Now we're gonna get crafty. We're gonna make a very simple trussing needle to sew the duck clothes. First, cut off a 12 inch section of twine. Now starting from the pointed tip, break off about a six inch section of the bamboo skewer. Hold the twine and skewer together with one hand. Now wrap clear tape around the twine and skewer in a downward spiral. When done, give the needle a quick twist and make sure the tape is on securely. Let's stuff the duck with orange wedges, green onions, crushed garlic, and crushed ginger. Keep alternating this combination until you run out of ingredients. You have to use a firm hand when stuffing the orange wedges. This helps to puff up the body. Let's take the trussing needle that we made earlier and let's double knot the ends. Okay, I'm not a very good sewer and this is probably the extent of my sewing abilities. So I'm gonna let you watch this part of the video and I'm gonna speed it up. After we're done sewing, grab both ends of the string and pull it taut. Snip off the needle and then tuck the ends inside the duck. Place the oiled paper bag over the roasting tray. Now place the duck inside the paper bag, positioning it toward the back of the bag. Fold the edges of the paper bag over. And now we staple the bag shut. This seals the hot air inside the bag and so the duck will cook faster and be very juicy. Please note the position of my oven rack. It is at the lowest setting possible because I have a really big roasting tray and I also don't want the paper bag too close to the heating element on the top. The rule for roasting a duck in a paper bag is 15 minutes per pound. Since my duck is five pounds, it should take 75 minutes total. 
While a duck is roasting, let's make our sweet and savory glaze. It's super simple. Just mix all the ingredients that I listed earlier and then combine everything together. Part one of the roasting is done and now we can remove the paper bag. Be careful when opening the bag as there's steam inside. Discard the paper bag and place the duck directly on the roasting tray. Now increase the oven temperature to 450 degrees. Brush a generous amount of the glaze all over the duck. This will give the duck its beautiful color, so make sure you brush it on evenly. Back into the oven it goes, and this time we bake for 15 minutes until it's nice and golden brown. I raise the oven rack one level, but again, we don't want it too close to the heating element. Our delicious roast duck is done. If you listen very carefully, you can hear it sizzling. Hey friends, Lunar New Year is just around the corner and there's a new playlist with lots of delicious recipes. Use the link to check out the playlist, Vietnamese New Year's Dishes, brought to you by Helen's Recipes, Vun's Kitchen, and myself, Runaway Rice. Hi, I hope you've enjoyed this easy how-to video. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to post below. For full recipes, check out runawayrice.com. I work on new recipes each week, so please subscribe to my channel to stay tuned. This is Trang wishing you good eating and good health. Thanks for watching.